Good morning, Joe Deary, Powerful Improvements, Putnam, Connecticut. I'm out here with both boys today. We got a lot of work to do. We're doing this multi-unit. It is three and a half stories to that peak. We've been hitting it no problem. The rain has passed. You can see some patchy blue sky. And I don't know, we got like five, maybe six projects today. We had to, we got rained out yesterday. We got one project done in the morning then it rained all day. So I moved uh, two of the projects into today and we'll make up the difference uh, elsewhere as we can. Uh, but again, this is a little bit outside of our normal footprint. This is outside of our normal type of project. It's nice to see that everything is hitting the peak here, no problem today. And uh, we'll be done in just a few. Done, no video. Sorry. All right, next house out here on Bungie Lake. This is our third time washing this property. This is a realtor friend of mine. She owns a big agency in Woodstock, Connecticut, Carol Reinowitz, CR Premier Properties. I got Quinn on soap mode, take care of this glass first, work our way around, back down to the truck to reel it up. Piece of cake. All right, we're on a nice little dormered cape out in Brooklyn, Connecticut, and I'm running the X6. I got Quinn out back. She's got panel fencing that goes way around the property. He's out back taking care of the fencing. This is our second year in a row here, so the house is not too dirty. We're doing some decking in the back, a couple little sheds, some lawn furniture. I just did gutter cleaning with the blower. We'll be back in the fall to do it again. And in order to accelerate a little bit, I'm jumping in with the X6 to try to help out in the front of the house. We got one more big project to do this afternoon. It's already like two in the afternoon, so trying to pick up a little bit of speed. We got one more big project and then a smaller project after that. It's gonna be a later than normal day for us. Had to sit out some rain, but that's okay. Water Boss X6. This backyard is spectacular. They gotta have close to an acre of land here, I would say. They got orchards, all sorts of stuff going on, plantings. We did all of this vinyl fencing only on this side. Little shed over there. Patrick's on the back of the house over here in rinse mode. He and Quinn have been taking turns a little bit. We're nearly done. We did all the railings, the deck, the wicker furniture, and another little shed around the corner. Coming back to do gutters again in the fall. And I'll be talking to them today about doing that rail fencing for them, maybe in the fall. A little add-on. See another little peekaboo shed there. Beautiful place. Big patch looking good. Look how healthy this kid is. 17 the other day. All right, so we're doing roof washing, house washing, and we just did uh, the gutters to start. Cranking this job out. Random dog showed up.
All right, I'm out front here on the 32 doing gutters and I tried doing them with the blower without success. Too packed with mud. It's been like three or four years, he said. We got a wiffle ball right there. I did the roof wash in the back. I got Patrick and Quinn working together to take care of the rest of the house wash in the back. I got the 5.5 up here with the X-Jet on 100 feet of hose. So I'm gonna try to rip this out with the X-Jet. I know I'm gonna make a mess, but we're doing a house wash, so it's okay. Last project and I believe this is the dirtiest side. <laughs> 